what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Shadyverse. I'm Shades and we're going to continue our Let's Play of Persona 3 Portable. Last time we left off, we beat the we encountered our third uh, full moon and we beat up our boss. So next time we go into Tartarus, that last barrier should be gone. But apparently we can't go into Tartarus tonight because um, the seniors aren't here. So whatever. Let's just go upstairs then. Uh, what's my uh, status right now? I'm tired, so I should go to sleep early. Hmm. He looks to be feeling well. Oh, what's going on? Oh, never mind, that happens just... Symbols, please. There we go. Go to bed early? Yes. Let's do that. So, anyway, guys. Um, before I get onto anything else, um, I am using a new recording program. It is free. It is called OBS. It... Again, you can't really complain a lot with uh, uh, free software. It's still the beta for Windows 7 and 8, and I will shall put a link in the description to to download if you so if you wish. If you want to start let's plays of your, of your own or just do screen capture or live streams or something like that, this software is perfect for you. It's a good starting place anyway. And no, I am not sponsored, but I uh, I do like spreading around this free t free uh, software that could help anyone. Anyway, good morning. You might like to know that Yamagishi and Moriyama are healing up well. That's good. Yes. We'll need to invite Yamagishi to the dorm and explain what happened. We could definitely use her help. Yeah. They could. We could. I, are we not up to the Kamakura era yet? I guess not. Oh man, we haven't even reached the Nara era. Well, let's go through it real quick. First, the Taikai reforms. They happened in the year 645. Just remember that. Huh? What were they about? Oh, nothing important, really. Later on in 7 710, there was the he Haijokyo that wraps it up for the Nara era. You feel tired. Close your eyes for a few minutes. Stay awake. What? You want to know more? Okay, there's a question for you about the Nara era. What's the name of the anthology consisting of about 4,500 poems leading up to the Nara era? I don't feel like picking on anyone today, so I'll just tell you. It's the Man Yoshu. We're supposed to cover the Kyokyo and Wakashu too, but I don't really care. Ask Mr. Akoda if you want. Ugh, I don't really care about any of this. Wow, what a great teacher. He only goes over what he wants to know. Eh, whatever. I want to get to the Sengoku area. It's calling out to me. <laughs> you stayed up and listened to the lecture. Your academics has increased. Yay! It's finally time for lunch. Who wants to hang out with me today? Yo, hey, oh, hey, Minato-kun, how are you doing? Are you free after school today? I'm available. Great, let's go somewhere together. See you after school. Oops, gotta run. It's time for class. See ya. It seems Yuko has nothing left for school today. The lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. So, I guess we're hanging out with Yuko after school today. Class is ended for today. Oh, and uh, by the way, uh, this uh, program I'm now using instead of Frabs, I set it for 60 frames per second, so maybe the video looks better, maybe it doesn't, I don't know. You can tell me in the comments, I don't know. I'm just testing it out for today. Hey, Minato-kun, I was wondering if what I should do since there's no practice today. Seems Yuko wants to walk home together. Yeah, let's spend some time with her. Great, let's go have fun. Yay, she seems happy. Iwatodai Strip Mall, Wakatsu Restaurant. The fried mackerel was good. Even though I eat lunch every day, I still get hungry after practice. I consider this an early dinner. I still eat dinner when I get home though. I really have to stop eating between meals or I'll gain tons of weight once I'm not so busy with the team. What? Hey Minatakun, do you think I eat too much? Hmm, more than likely we're gonna have to go the with the enabler route. Meaning that we just do whatever that makes her happy, but in all honesty, I do that in real life too, but then again, I, I would just say like, oh, it doesn't matter to me. Whatever you eat, it's up to you. Just so long as you're healthy, I don't care. But let's go with not really. I agree. I just eat a little more than your average girl, right? I'm sure I burn off the extra calories during practice. Yuko seems amused. You live in the dorm, right, Minato-kun? Not to pry, but you must love being around good-looking girls like Mitsuru and Yukari. Oh no, she getting jelly. <gasps> oh my god, can we flirt? Let's do it. Wow, you're a dangerous combination smooth talker and a handsome guy. Well, <laughs> I am the protagonist. <laughs> I, I, I won't forget the compliment, though. Uh, maybe even maybe I'll even tell you, Kari. 
Yuko seems Yuko seems happy. If I bump into her a few years from now at the Polonia Mall, I'll tell her then. <laughs> That's funny. I'm too lazy to go on a diet. I wouldn't last a single day. It all it takes is motivation. Just say I'm doing it for my health. And I will love it when I'm older. And I could still do backflips. <laughs> I've decided I'm gonna stop eating between meals. My first goal is to tone down my arms. Did you hear that, Minuto Kun? You're my witness. Yukos told her, told you about her resolution. Your relationship is now stronger. Rank up, strength level three. Oh yeah, the team manager social link has reached level three. Your power to create personas of the strength arcana has grown. Yuko seems to think of you as someone who's easy to talk to. However, you're still just casual acquaintances. Oh shoot, it's already this late? Let's go. Yeah, otherwise I might be tempted to order something else. Blush. Yuko seems really happy. Alright, let's go. After saying goodbye to Yuko, you decide to go back to the door. Sup, dude. Sup. I th they're at the hospital again, visiting Fuka, so I guess we're not going anywhere tonight. Man, I wonder when she'll be ready to come along. Hey, don't just don't just assume that she'll be joining us. I hope they're not trying to push her into it. Mm, that's true, it's always her choice. Let's grab a save. But considering that she, this, they've made a big deal of her being in the game, a big deal of her, more than likely she is joining us. Of course, I already know this since I played the game before. Sorry for the spoiler, I should have put that up there. Spoiler alert! But again, it should be obvious that she is joining us. Uh, my status is good, right? So I should just, like, study since we're not going to Tartarus anytime soon. You have decided to study. Your academics has increased. You're feeling sleepy. You have studied enough for tonight. It's finally time for lunch. Nothing happened in the morning? Hmm. Hey, Minato. Are you going to practice today? I haven't decided yet. Oh well, I'll definitely be there, but I might be a little late. Don't worry about my knee, alright? Later. It seems ki like Kazushi is hiding something. Maybe have, maybe you should go to kendo practice after school. Okay, let's see if anyone else wants to hang out with me today. Huh, just him? Okay then. Unfortunately... Oh god, what's going on? I'm getting a call. You received a text message. It's from Akihiko. Fuka is being released from the hospital. We'll talk to her this evening. Come to the command room as soon as you get back. I just realized I haven't talked to that little girl who was at the park. Or the old couple. Huh. Kazushi it is. Hey bro, is it time for practice? Be going ahead. For some reason, Kazushi doesn't seem like himself. Since- okay, I'm not reading that. Just go to practice today? Go to practice. I'll catch up later. The Kukran High School Gymnasium. The Kendo team is giving it everything they've got. The workout is tough but fun. You don't see Kazushi. After tra finishing the training, you decide to go back to the dorm. What's going on? The Kukran High School Main Lobby. You see Kazushi. H hey, Minato! What's up? You're probably wondering where I've been. The hospital again? You remember what we talked about last time? Of course you do. You remember everything. Kazushi seems a little happier now. I just got back from the hospital. They had the results for my last exam. Hey, Minato. I... Ugh. Kajushi tries to get up but fell to his knees. Damn it! I can't! Let him use your shoulder. Thanks, Minato. Sorry to be such a pain. Kajushi seems happy. Funny, huh? I was trying to tie my shoes and I fell. It's a good thing you were around. If it had been someone else, then, then the rest of the team would have found out. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Kajushi seems appreciative. Your relationship is stronger now. I can't, ooh, rank 5, yes! Again, this is only useful if you ever fuse Personas, and I don't do that very often. Your power to create the Persona, Terry Arcana is a grown, blah blah blah. I'm gonna go train by myself. I have to train even though practice is over. The big meat's not that far off. You're leaving, right? Later, dude. Let's train together sometime. Dude, your health is in danger. Why are you pushing yourself so hard? You just had to go back to the dorm. We're going to the command room, right? Oh, yeah. The dormitory command room. The chairman and Fuka are sitting here along with the others. The color has returned to Fuka's face since the, her ordeal. You're Fuka Yamagishi, right? Yes. <laughs> 
Relax. There's no need to be nervous. Why don't you have a seat? Oh, thank you. Everyone, you did an excellent job uncovering the truth. I also wanted to let you know the three girls have all regained consciousness. That's good. What a relief. From what I understand, they each came to school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. They were attacked by shadows near the gate as the dark hour began. However, the facts became twisted because of rumors concerning a ghost story. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. It's all my fault. No, it's not. Are you kidding? You were the victim. You go, Yukari. There's no victim shaming here. But I made so many people worry. And that's not your fault. You just got too stuck in a bad situation. Hey, don't think like that. See, Yukari understands. We could have lost that fight if you weren't there. Yeah. You saved our lives. You should feel good about yourself. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. You could be a tremendous help to us. Will you lend us your strength? Are you asking me to join you? No. <laughs> That's correct. Mitsura-senpai. I think you'd make a good addition to the team, too. Akihiko-senpai. You know, we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it... I'll do it. I'll help you. Are you sure? That was quick. If you join, you'll have to live here. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. Oh dear, what's going on at home? We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Thank you. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Um, it's okay, really. Now then, those special shadows showed up again. We still don't know where they're coming from. But Akihiko is right about one thing. Their appearances seem to coincide with the full moon. We'll take that into consideration from now on. So they're kind of like werewolves then, huh? Oh my god, Junpei. For the love of god, shut up! Uh, and just for the record, I don't hate Junpei. It's just he says such stupid things sometimes. Then again, so do I, so I guess we relate on that level. It's a big advantage for us to know when to expect them. That's true. Now, on the day of the fight, we'll be ready to get in the ring. <sighs> you discovered a special pattern in the appearance of special shadows. You're wonder you wonder if this is what the boy was trying to tell you. It seems that, that you should start paying attention to the moon's phases. Yeah, as the moon gets fuller, we get you get more and more powerful shadows. But honestly, that, that just means that grind runs should be done prior to full moon. Which I usually do. Off screen, of course. Because I I really should stop like trying to put grind runs in, in during the recording. Because it, it just wastes time, honestly. So, instead of wasting my time and wasting you guys' time, I am going to go here. And since, we, again, we can't go to Tartarus because Mitsuda and Ora and Akihiko were not in the... Um, lobby, we are just gonna study again and try to increase that intelligence. You have decided to study. That's a lot of writing. Your academics has increased. Oh, yeah, above average. <laughs> yeah, go to bed. Ooh. Morning. Hey, Minato kun, what do you think about Fuka? She's very helpful. She, she's cute. You can go the Junpei route, or you can go the practical route. You think so? I mean, yeah, her persona ability is great and all, but... Doesn't it kind of seem like she was forced into joining us? Not really. I mean, like, we just said that we could use her help and how useful her abilities are. But, like, it's not like it's not like we, like, pushed the evoker into her hand. But it seems like she really wanted to help. I hope she'll be okay. Me too. But knowing that she's she's a main character helps her survival rating. Gekugan High School, classroom 2E. Hey, did you hear? Oh no. Ikoda's in hot water. Oh no. Really? What do you do? Uh, I hate people like this. I don't know, but it must be serious. Sexual harassment, maybe. God freaking damn it, I hate people like this. Oh, I can totally see that. Uh, can I punch them in the nose? Just the nose. Good morning. Ooh, 
<sighs> hey, look. It's the ghost girl. Oh god, punch them in the nose. They deserve it. No, they deserve it even more now. Quiet, she can hear you. It doesn't matter if she can hear you. You don't say those things regardless. I'm gonna punch them in the nose. Fuka, you in here? Oh no. Moriyama-san? I heard you started living in the dorms. Yeah. You seem so depressed. Let me know if you need someone to talk to. Oh wow, they're friends now? You could probably use a friend, huh? Well, at least she had a change of heart. That's good. Moriyama-san. Oh, come on. Just call me Natsuki. Thank you.